Hey guys and welcome back to another video. And today's video is going to be a vloggy type video. Um, and I'm going to tell you a little story uh, that happened. So, it was about like eight years ago. I studied eight, nine years ago. I studied Shiatsu therapy. Um, I did it professionally and then I ended up having to stop just because I couldn't handle it. I had my own stuff I had to deal with and I wasn't doing that. Um, so eventually I, I had to stop um, and then I was like working on myself for a little while. Um, but finally I, after doing like the improv and like all this personal growth stuff, I've been able to actually put my foot back in there. And a little bit small, you know, like I, I'm doing an exchange with a friend, um, and it was like a house call type thing. So I had like a, a mat, and I was actually on my way to his house, um, <laughs> and so, and I was dressed up like this, you know, I, I had my work hat, my fedora work hat, I had my leather jacket, um, and I had my backpack, which is not a cheap backpack, it's huge. It's like a $200 backpack on. And I had my mat, which I don't currently have on me at this moment. But anyways, so I was traveling to my friend's place. I was on a streetcar. Um, it was a little out of the ways. And I'm sitting there. There's this guy to my right. Um, I would say maybe he was at like a two o'clock. Um, at my, anyways. Um, so he's like sitting there, and he keeps glancing over at me. And I'm like, okay, why is he doing that? Um, and I'm just like, you know what? Maybe he's just a nervous person. Maybe he feels like he wants to talk to me for whatever reason. Maybe he just wants to be friendly. But uh, he's just feeling awkward. And I'm like, okay, well, whatever. I'm just gonna sit here and, like, enjoy the ride. So, it was like, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes later. I'm getting close to my stop. And the guy turns to me. He pulls out what looks like a pork bun from, like, Chinatown. And he's like, oh, do you want this? And I'm like, oh, jeez thinks I'm homeless. Despite having my work hat on, a leather jacket, and a $200 backpack, I still look homeless. That seems to be a phenomenon, apparently, if I'm carrying my mat with me. My mat is not my bed. I am not going to go and sleep under a bridge or in a park or in, like, a little bank, uh, ATM place. <laughs> but, it's like, as soon as people see this mat, they think I'm homeless. I, even when I was, like, back, uh, before I quit, um, doing Shiatsu the first time, I carried, uh, a mat that was actually crappier, um, and somebody, like, offered me a token of the TTC. I'm like, wow, I'm not homeless. Um, I could totally use that, but uh, I'm not one of those people. Um, it's just, it feels weird. But anyways, that's my story, and I thought I'd share that with you guys. And uh, yeah, so I will see you guys in the next video.